good morning. I am doing something else somewhere else, but I did want to pop in and say thank you. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Lock Practition. I realized I said that really slow. And this vlog is going to be just a completion of so many like clips of things I took in the making of Blackoween and making sure that um, everything felt smooth and decisions I had to make. Just so many things involving Blackoween will be in this vlog. And I did it vlog style for a reason because I knew it would be so many different clips. So I, I'm really excited to show y'all what is happening and how I go into creating Blackoween. There are more stuff but I thought that I would make like a behind the scene video this year. So enjoy. I know this lighting ain't great. I know it ain't, but there's no other choice. Um, but I did want to come in and give a review. So what I plan to do right now is sit on my couch. Um, I do want to organize something, but I need to let my phone charge to do that because I want to organize sounds that I want to use for Black Halloween to promote Black Halloween um, pretty heavily in October on TikTok. And then I do want to upgrade or like just get better on my, my tracking sheet, like where you track where you're reading. I do want to do that. And I'm also thinking about... Um, how I'm gonna set up some other stuff for content. Just to do a little bit every day so I can just head out. And I'm also trying to work on something that I'm gonna give as a spoiler to my Patreons um, for the 30 spoilers in 30 days. And by the time you see this video, those um, spoilers will be done. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'll see that. Or will they be done? I, I don't know, but stay tuned, you know? This is the basket I have. Hopefully this is enough to fit a lot of the items that I need for the Noir Apothecary boxes. So um, I'm gonna try to put everything in this box, in this thing so that I can just go to this when I'm making the boxes for them. So we're just gonna go through some of the items that I'm gonna put in here. I'm gonna try to make sure I have 20 of these and then 20 of these and my camera is dying but hopefully I can give you some other content of how I'm going to be doing these. Alright I have not a big working table 
or a working station. Let me try to cut off the fan. Okay, got the door open so the heat should come in. I'm gonna try to cut everything with some of this burlap. All right, so I wanna take out a couple of these so that I can count them. And these are my um, uh, business cards from my Etsy shop. So I have a bunch of stickers here. Uh, I try to keep these protected because I buy them from the same company. Um, but I think though, this year, um, I'm gonna put the black ween stickers in the boxes, I think. Um, I might sell these as extras. I haven't thought about that, but these are the black ween stickers, so I will sell them separately maybe. I don't know. I also don't want to add any more work. I'll tell you that. I do not want to add any more work. I might do like a little thing to send to my Patreons. I might do that. But yeah. So, let's count out how many stickers I need. year so I will put that to the side I haven't really decided how I'm going to organize the box um, but I've been buying so much like material and stuff over the years that I don't think I have to go out and buy any more material I think I just have what I have so one two three four five six seven eight I did 21 just as a just an extra and has nothing to do with if you can do something for me <laughs> oh that cracked me up um, Yes, these are 20. Um, and last year I bought a bunch of these. Um, I try to make the back a little bit different, but um, I really liked how I had this in the back here. So, you know, we do what we can. So that is, I think it might be 20 or 21, I don't know. Not me losing count already. Y'all, I don't want to be judged. I don't want to be judged. Go ahead and um, get this down. Alright, so we have three items packed and ready to go. Now this next one I'm unsure about. So, I'm hoping this is 20. I had a bunch of these. I don't know where they went. One, 
I don't use these, but I keep them and I reuse them over and over for other things like this. So I found one um, because I use just the reusable ones. But when somebody give me one, I just hold on to it for dear life. But anyway, I found this one um, in my craft box. Y'all, this is my favorite sticker because it is holograph. Y'all didn't ask for this, but that's where we're at. But anyway, um, let me recount. One, two, three. Now, I think that I'm going to personalize these two again. Um, it was personalized for the, for the cards last time, but this will be personalized. I have a stamp that I ordered that's going to go on top of this, and then I'm going to personalize them. I hate that I'm just doing 20 boxes, but that's literally all I have the space for. So, these are ready to go. Um, I'm going to wrap these up as well. Alright, so for one piece of it, I have that done. Okay, so we have this in there. That's counted for. The um, bookmarks are accounted for. The cards are accounted for and then the stickers are accounted for there is a note that i need to do and i'm trying to decide well it's already 6 30 the library closed at 7. so this is the box that all the items will go into um this is an old box with an old sleeve that i can still sell. Man, this was sturdy. Huh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Not me surprised by my own wheel. Now, I haven't decided if I'm going to add um, these teas. And I think I should because I feel like even if you don't drink tea, you should share it with someone else. Um, and I have so many teas and I partnered with um, Steep and Sip for the Noir Apothecary boxes. I just don't know if it'll fit. So that's kind of where I'm at with the teas and I ordered these things um not cheap by the way not cheap but I ordered these um for like 50 people and was like well I'll find a project for them but I'm doing a note that goes into the noir pot to carry boxes and I just want to see how it fits look at that I ain't gotta cut nothing I'm going to do a little test run today and see see how that goes. But um, let's just put this down. i got to keep this box with me so I can try to figure out how I want the box to look. It shouldn't take me too long. So right here, this is the box where the soaps are in. So I am going to... Um, I'm going to put this in the container because I do want people to have her card that's in the container. Um, this is something for me. I believe they're for me. Some thank you cards that um, she sent me as well. I can randomly put those in some of the box. It don't look like it's enough for 20, but um, I'm going to make sure people know who made these. This is my personal soap. I'm going to put this in the bathroom and probably try it. I think I'll try it today actually okay so these are the black wean soaps this is what the packaging looks like um, shout out to her for making them for me um, in the colors that I liked as well so um, these have unrefined shea butter hemp seed oil Extra, extra virgin olive oil, unrefined coconut oil, castor oil, water, fragrance oil, and mica um, colorants. Um, so yeah, I need to get some mica. But anyway, for external use only, I repeat, for external use only. So I'm going to count out 20 of these. So I'm going to put them in here as I count them out because it's just more room in the box. So... One, two, um, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 
13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Nineteen twenty. This leaves me with an inventory of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I have ten soaps left over. So yep, yeah, we have the twenty soaps in here, and I'm feeling I'm feeling pretty good about that. Um, yeah, I am. All right, if we take a moment to go to Canva, we're gonna go to this, um, which is something I created. Now I wanna make sure that the grammar is right. So we're gonna go to Grammarly. So I put this on Grammarly. I like it to be creative, tell a story even, and you know, that's it. So, and I have dyslexia, so I I can't be out here embarrassing myself like this. So we're just letting the system go. by six we also made sure that it was the photo matte paper for the media type um, the media type that this is asking for doesn't exist on here so I'm out here uh, fishing in the dark as they say so I'm gonna put it in my printer and we'll see what it looks like So I'm glad we tried, um, and this was wrong. Quartet, quartet, quartet. Look at that. Look at that. All right, I am so pumped that um, this printed well. So I used a bag that I would use for my, um, for my, uh, I usually would put these cards in this bag because it does, this design is specifically for these. But I'm trying to figure out like a mock way to make these um, boxes. So let's, I don't need to worry about the extra like material to put it in there to keep it cute. I just need to know like would everything fit. So we're going to do a mock one here. If you hear the printer, the printer is going to. We got a situation here. So at the bottom, we have some of this stuff here, which is fine. I'm also going to grab this just in case. So let's say I'm just going to use random things because I don't want to mess up what I already put away for this. So I think we can put this here. Hold on, I got to grab a mock... Um, I need to grab a mock bath salt. I'll be right back. So I bought some things. So I forgot that I had these. So I need to count um, 20 of these. I don't know how many of those I bought, but I bought way too many. i tell you that right here. But like I said, just extra content. So for this mock-up one, 
So here are the shells. Put a couple of shells inside of here. So let's say we put the shells here. We have the bookmark. We have the pen. Let me just get a couple cards. This would be the thank you cards as the mock-up. Just, just seeing how things are gonna go. So we're gonna put this the shell. We have the we have the salts. Actually, I should use the salt. So I've been making a lot of bath salts, um, like for myself just to try. And like this coarser type of salt, I've found to be my favorite when it comes to a bath. Like this, this is, this is good. Um, anyway, if anyone, um, I'll do it in my announcement video if I haven't already done. Let me make a note that if people want the lavender flavor, I mean the lavender um, bath salt, just to tell me. Because I did make a small batch of those, but for the most part, it'll be a citrus smell. Okay, so I just made a note of that, so I don't forget. But anyway, so we have this, we have the shells, we have the black wing soap. We can put in this, I believe. Um, we can also put in this bookmark, we can put that in the back. Put that here, the two stickers. Um, and then the two of those things and it looks like we got everything we need bath salt stickers bookmark where is the note so then I put the note here and then I'm gonna design another note which is like specifically like thank you for supporting blah 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 but that is the box and I think it'll be a little lightweight too so I'm trying to think if like um, I also thought about um, bringing these back. I do have a lot of bottles um, of bringing this one back as well, which is just the lavender spray, and it's really good. Be the one that I was like, it's giving broke, and just put it to the side because it don't even have a label on it. Um, but yeah, but man, that smells awesome. Anyway, I might bring this back. Like it's all of it is giving wellness honestly and truthfully and then and i have some body scrubs that i'll use as an add-on but overall i seem i seem pretty uh content with this and if i put other stuff in it like it can keep it safe it won't be knocked around i like this that was my issue last time I felt like stuff was just bumping through the night. So this is a nice mock-up. I'm going to put this in here too just in case. I don't know how many of those I have left honestly. But um, this is the mock-up box. Alright y'all. Um, I went on my Etsy. I deleted some stuff that I needed to delete. Um, and I also up like you know upgrade not upgraded what was it i updated what i had on there for like stuff that i was selling so like we were talking about yesterday this bin has all the stuff that i keep trying to add to it and i think i think everything should be able to fit but i'm really unsure but I've decided to actually put the tea um, in the box. So I need to get 20 of these. So let's do that. Today's the next day and I'm tired. So let me just let y'all know what I've been up to. So I went to the thrift store today. I got some stuff that I needed. 
um, and I got something unexpected, which are like these um, things that you can organize your clothes with. They were like 99 cent. So um, I actually been needing some of them for my socks. So I'll like, I'll, I want to put a clip in of me doing the socks, but we'll see um, after this whole little thing that I'm doing right now. What am I doing? Losing my mind because I'm tired and feeling incoherent on the internet but anyway um i'm doing that i just uh got some other stuff done um i am listening to this book called sisters of the lost nation um it is following the story of this young girl it seems to be mainly from this young girl's um perspective uh and it's about her family and there's something going on in her community but I'm unsure what that is right now so that's where I'm at um, I do plan to finish that today I took a break on don't fear the reaper um, I will say I'm only I'm half percent now which I'm half percent I'm 50 percent done with it now that I'm having a hard time finishing the book if that makes sense and that's happened to me several times so that's where I'm at with Don't Fear the Reaper. Um, and yeah, I got some stuff that I need to do for my Patreon. Stuff I need to do for other like jobs. Um, at the thrift store, I found like a really cool plant stand for the low. I think it's like five bucks. Um, and it's just really dope. And it's going to fit a plant that I put outside in the summer. But I bring it in in the winter. So I have some other plants in it right now but i really like it i don't know what's going on i think i broke out or i'm allergic to something so if you see a mark in the middle of my face that happens every once in a while i don't even know what that's about but anyway that's what i'm doing i'm gonna continue to listen i am on patreon sprints and um i am getting things done it's just happening slowly but i am i am feeling like i'm on top of it because i have like i don't plan to be shipping out these boxes boxes i don't plan on um shipping out these boxes until like mid-september and today is august 5th and i'm getting together i already took out my scents um to do more bath salts um waiting on a shipment
to do it i've been trying to do this specific video for a long time so i'm happy that you've done it um let me know if you'll be interested in me doing a vlog like this next year as well anyway don't forget to like comment and subscribe and y'all i'm sorry i'm just out here in these streets you know what i'm saying and i will see you later bye